Warning, don't talk with people season two we decided to take out the sensor to provide more authentic experience. It is not a mission to offend anyone, so we apologize in advance if we offend you. The majority of the things said on this show are not actual facts. Rather, these are true, freely expressed opinions. Mainly look at this show as comedy, entertainment, or both. However, we do hope someone between the donuts and the people eating them that you are able to take something away from watching the show, even if it's a laugh. Bush on, cush on, cush on. You about to get some points. <laughs> you look like a moose. That's what you look like Wednesday, a whole moose. Saying so, if you get with a player like me, I ain't gonna be thirsty for these other bitches. You gotta hold up on the game. Hell yeah. I mean, well, I feel like addiction is a choice. Nah, addiction is not a choice. It's addiction to what? To That's... me? Oh, hell no! Why do you say that? I feel like that first step prior to addiction. You have to, yes. You have to. You have to choose to do it. You got to lead into addiction. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You ever see me at Thanksgiving when I take that first plate and I'm still hungry and I go after for the second one? And before I make the second one, I make the plate to go home. That's addiction, man. That's a choice. So, like, people that eat rocks, right? Like, that's a real addiction, though. <laughs> like, people chew on rocks. Like, they like the the, the, the taste of, like, rocks and grinding on their teeth. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? No. The first time is a choice, and then the rest is just an addiction. Well, I, don't, I don't know what weird shit you're reading up on, but... <laughs> um... <laughs> If any niggas out here saying addiction is a choice, <laughs> niggas never did drugs before, in my opinion. <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> you don't come out the womb when to put like your finger in a girl's butt, like you know what I mean? Like you gotta do it a couple times to figure out if you like it or not, then do it like three times, then you out here just you addicted to putting your finger in girls' butts. When I was a little kid, I was saying, ew, girls, ew, vagina. <laughs> I got some vagina. <laughs> And goddamn, that Boy. shit was good. Fuck. Yeah. What about babies that are born addicted to like crack and shit? Uh, shit. Damn. Mm. That's mm. a wrench. Deep. That's facts. <laughs> <laughs> she like she want my finger in the butt. <laughs> <laughs> Women get addicted to to this dick, and you know, and they feel like they they want to um, catch feelings and whatnot. What about human trafficking? And then when they drug the girls, and they become addicted to drugs. I was on it. I need me. I need some vagina right after this, bro. That them joints be warmer than underneath my man boob. You feel me? Like that Ooh. shit. <laughs> oh lord! Oh lord! In my head, I'm just thinking out of all things. Uh, you like fingers in your butt? I was like in your butt, so you got more than one butt. <laughs> I'm gonna take this pussy. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna take this is some good ass pussy. I ain't gonna lie. Well, you a thought, so <laughs> I'm always gonna be one. It is what it is. <laughs> Your balls are filthy. <laughs> Go to the ball washer. Meow. Hell yeah. I mean. <laughs> nah, F out of here. Addiction is a it is a choice until you're an addict. Nah, it's a choice, but I ain't really feeling it. I Bro, that that's addiction. That's not by choice. They're I'm, forced to do I'm drugs. I'm still not feeling bad for that child. Yo. Drugs is bad. Stay away from it. You, you, you avoid the addiction. And don't ride on your teeth with the rocks, you heard? Stay away from drugs, unless it's weed, it's all natural, it's good for the body, fuck what the doctors say. Like I was saying, addiction is definitely a choice, you know what I'm saying, so if you can get some good ass pussy or some good ass head, that's definitely an addiction right there. You can't front on that. I know. You Everybody else some sloppy toppy, stop playing with me. I said an addiction to a drug, drug is like, like an addiction, addiction to, a to a woman. Once you get a taste, you want more and more? You want more and more. You get that high, you want to feel that mm -hmm. way all the time. Nah, you, you know want to bust the nut, bro. No. I'm gonna tell you why I love abortion, right? Abortion to me is like, it gives you the choice to get rid of a child that you don't want. You do, you can, you, you want, you want. I mean, sometimes dudes get caught up with some chicks they don't really care for and you know, they gotta pay out the pocket. Men can't really have an opinion on it. To be honest, you probably shouldn't have you nutted in her. Why y'all, you know what I'm saying, having that feel good real sex if she not on um, birth control? You get an abortion? You're a monster. You should be ashamed of yourself. All right. But if I get you pregnant, you're getting an abortion. I'm not. I'm not ready to have no kids. Don't you feel like everyone should be like born with an abort button right here? Facts, B. Abort. <laughs> abort. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's serious. Cause they be acting like they be taking the pill and they won't be taking that shit. There's a lot of people having raw sex. As a fact. And having trust issues at the same time, which makes no type of sense. <laughs> Young teenager, Plan B. I can understand. Mm -mm. 
condoms, man. Simple as that. You know what I mean? Women do got to realize that's not going to save a relationship. So, of, of course, the guy's going to suggest an abortion and the woman's going to want to keep it. But, like, I got a dick appointment tomorrow. Abort? <laughs> Stop. Just, just use a condom. It's not worth it. Or you're allergic to latex. That's true, but that's they make the sheepskin for that though. No. Huh? No. They got sheepskin. No, I know, but no. I heard sheepskin get it in. No. <laughs> you tried it? <laughs> I had to. And also, they got the ultra up. thin joints, you feel me? I mean I strap up. Ain't trying to nobody out here. For real, dick be too good. They don't know how to act. <laughs> Rated on a one through ten though. That is a four. Out of five? Out of 10. Dead ass? Yeah. Don't, it got the holes in it. And Nothing everything. is better than raw. That's why you have That's to facts. go through a process. Abortion wow. should be like an option for females to do always, whatever, always. whatever they want, no matter my, the religion. My greatest fear in life is being raped. I, I, I'm, I wouldn't say I'm against it. I'm not for it. It's whatever the, the girl feels that she wants for her body. It's her decision at the end of the day, man. You're stuck no matter mm. what. It shouldn't come down to the abortion. But what did Frank Ocean say? Oh shit, Frank Ocean, um, does he even count? He, like, okay. No I, smoke. It's a serious topic, also, your sister. Because there's some cases where, you know, women's safety and everything, I completely understand. I will never judge anybody. When when you gotta take them to take a plan B, you literally have to make them do it right in front of you. Otherwise, right. they're gonna keep the baby. <laughs> so. Consent. Oh, yeah, let's talk about consent. <laughs> <laughs> I used to, look, I was on game a long time ago, fam. You can ask my ex, B. Strapped up. So if you get pregnant, that mean you poked a hole in my condom. When the religion forbids you from aborting that child, that's effed up, son. Okay. When I would take off her pants, I'd be like, yo, can, is it okay if I take off your pants? I used to do that shit so much where she got annoyed and she's like, yo, listen, you don't gotta ask me to take off my pants. I was like, all right. You know what I like? What, when somebody asks that shit? No, when a guy asks me to take it out. Take his penis out? You take it out. Yikes. You getting an abortion. Females is doing that, man. They be trying to get that state money, man. Income tax season coming around. You know what I told you about girls in the makeup tax, man. I never said take it out, but I, I am the type that was like, I'm not gonna put it in, you put it in. I like that. Like she's like, nah, nigga, you, you made that nigga rape you. Now you gotta keep the kid. Like uh, like like Benson from uh, Law and Order. You know what? I just think you're trying to like save yourself the embarrassment of, you know how sometimes guys can't find the hole right away? Oh! You put it in so that we don't have to go to a 15 second where it where. No, no, no. Okay, the first time that ever happened, I think there's truth in that. There's definitely a little bit of truth in that. 5,000 a kid, bro. Better hope you don't spit out kid, uh, twins. I mean, then, then I'm, I'm getting cut to you know, I get that right. Nah. Yeah, that's that's abortion for you. No. Check up. That's one. Damn, they gonna love me for this. I got these donuts. Yeah, I got them donuts, yo. Yeah, 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 donuts. Donuts. Make sure you got me one of them blueberries, man. Yeah, what's up with those? Yo, too. What are you doing, bro? I'm trying to get a donut. I'm trying to get a donut, too. Where my donut at? If y'all want some donuts, y'all can take your asses down to 116 Connecticut Ave, No Wall, Connecticut. Man, man shut, shut up! up. Oh, Well, damn. Use the code DTWS when making your purchase and get 10% off your order. Offer ends December 25th, 2018. Hey, Mr. and Mrs. Dover, um, I actually have some bad news. Um, oh, shit, hold on. One second. Look at me. Everybody dies, B. They will be all right. I'm just keeping, I'm just cut to the chase. Operating on your son, and I fucked up big time. I'm not even gonna lie to you, family. <clears throat> I knew this cat from way back. I'm sorry. Um... Charlotte passed away. Technically it was my fault, but actually it's not really my fault because what I wanted to do was go to school for music. I know he didn't. I'm the cause of this motherfucker dying and everything. Was I trying to help him? Hell no. I don't got no fucking white coat. Do I look like I could do anything to save a life right now? No. We couldn't, couldn't resurrect him. We couldn't bring him back. But then I went to medical school because it was more money. Being a doctor, it's, it's not easy. You know, we were, we were doing all the right steps. But more money, more problems. This is a problem that I'm having. I'm so sorry. I was waiting for this chance for maybe like eight, eight years ago. Um, yeah, so, yeah, your son dead. Um, shit like that. Uh, shit happens, you know, somebody's supposed to go left, they went right, cut his shit. Apparently it was me, but 
You understand? I, I had to get a degree for this. Like, obviously, if you can be a doctor, you did it yourself. So, me, me, and, me and Dr. Johnny Sims gave her the thing, and, you know, at least she, she, went, she went happy. Maybe it wasn't the best way, but she went, she went to have him satisfied. So, again, I'm sorry. We tried everything we could. We did use a lot of Pepto-Bismol. Um, I don't know how it happened. Like, one minute I thought I had it, the next minute I didn't. But you'll be all right. Make a new one. You know how it go down. Do, 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 do. Hold on, let me finish reading this shit. Huh? What? I, I said he's dead. But then I just gave it to God, and God said, it's his time to move on. If there's a God and everything, I hope he found him, because shit, I was trying to goddamn kill this son of a bitch in there. I did nothing. All right, and hold on. I, I know I made a mistake, but you need to tell your husband you don't have to look at me that way. So, I mean, I can't mess with God's plan. Damn right. You shouldn't have brought him to my goddamn hospital. Fuck you. Feel free to sue the hospital because, um... Yeah, God damn it! Die slow, motherfucker. And I hope if there's pain in the afterlife, I hope your ass is hurting right now. Fuck you. You go crazy. <laughs> nah, I'm sorry about that. Bro. Like seriously, if you can shoot the five, I, you will be joining your son in a little bit. If you keep looking at me like that, I made a goddamn mistake. All right. If I didn't drop a little, the cup of Hennessy I had in his wound, he would have still been here. So I apologize for that. Sorry. Sue the hospital. And fuck you too, miss, for bringing this little bastard into the world. What do you want me to do? He's dead. He's not coming back. I don't, what do you want to argue for? I don't, it doesn't, doesn't matter whose fault it is. He's dead. I really don't understand. Okay. All right. See, you came to me. I offer you my help. I did the best that I... Man, man what's up, man? You too, pops. What, you want to see me afterwards? Let's do this. Fuck it. I'm your doctor. Like that. Sprinkle question. What color is blueberry jam? Ooh. Final answer? Oh, I got this shit right. Purple, purple, it's purple. It's purple, purple. Well, it ain't blue, that joint be purple. Hey! Yeah! Purple. What? I'm scared. <laughs> Fade like an indigo, like an indigo blue. Yeah. Dark grape? No, dark purple. I mean, that's the color. That's the dark grape that we're gonna cover. Purple. Purple.